guys, welcome back again to my channel. This is going to be the two-part video of the last video I just made. Um, it's new model pickups, models for sale, and in-progress models. Um, this part of the video is just new model pickups. Uh, the first one is a 1995 Chevy Corvette. It's the last ZR1. I guess this is a model of the last ZR1 that was made. Um, I got it as is. I don't remember what I paid for it, but the box is damaged in, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the car out, and I'm just going to put a, a piece of clear tape over it to hold the plastic up. But the overall box is in good condition. I don't really have to say much about it, because I didn't build it. I just bought it as is. Um, it come, the color is torch red. The engine is a 5.7 liter dual overhead cam V8, 405 horsepower. Transmission is a six-speed manual, real weird drive. The production is 6,939 actual ZR1s unit per produced since production introduction in 1990. It's a lot of words on it, but I don't think you guys want to listen to, uh, to me talk for 15 minutes. But very good red color. I think I might take it apart and detail it. I'm not really sure yet, but very good color. I absolutely love it second kit i'm actually very proud of myself that i was actually able to find this and i paid i don't know necessarily if it's good because i know they can go for at least what i what i've seen like four times as much money i got the taurus the amt Ertl taurus uh police car and three things about this kit that i like one is the box art, uh, California Highway Patrol, I believe it is. Yeah, it's a CHP car. I just, I can't, I love the black and white color way that California used on some of their cars. Um, two is the fact that this is still factory wrapped, all right, for its age. And three, this kit from 1990. All right, still factory wrapped. This is a 31 year old model. All right, 31 year old model that is still factory wrapped, and the and the box is immaculate. There is no damage on it whatsoever, except for the little corner right here. There is no damage on it whatsoever. Literally nothing wrong with it. I am super glad uh, that I was able to pick this up for the amount of money that I paid for it. Um, I'm not sure if I'll build it. I put it in the future giveaway. I mean, I might sell it i might build it as a police car i'm not sure yet and i'm saving the <clears throat> best for last here um i actually picked up my very first timia kit it's uh i don't know what year it is i think it's a 95 uh a nissan skyline gtr v-spec and i got this from a local hobby shop that the place is called uh, Walt's Hobby Shop in um, Crest Hill, Illinois, but it's a 95, I believe it's 95 to 96, I believe it's a Nissan Skyline GTR V-Spec, it's a Tamiya kit, fun fact, it is my very first Tamiya kit, and it just caught my eye, I've, I've never heard anything negative about Tamiya kits, so I'm, I, I think my chances are pretty good with this one, um, I was looking around the box and it says 1995 here. So this means this is a 26 year old model kit that is still factory wrapped. I don't know how it goes that long without the box being damaged, but I'm thinking I might actually build this and not just let it sit in my stash. So if you guys have any paint ideas, if you think I should build it as you know one of the box arts here, let me know down in the comments. Um, I don't know when I'll be building it but definitely not anytime soon because I got four models on the bench that I need to finish. But uh, let me go, let me know uh, what you guys think I should do with it. Should I uh, lower it? Should I put a Hemi in it? Um, you know, I'm not going to put a Hemi in it, but let me know, should I buy tires for it? Should I buy wheels for it? You know, should I make a drift car? What should I do? Um, otherwise, that's it for the, sh uh, this is a short video. This is the Skyline. Taurus and the 95 ZR1 Corvette.
So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you next time. Thank you for watching.